Oh my God. <laughs> good okay, morning, bye. good morning, good morning, good morning. Good morning, everybody. Welcome, welcome. We are back. What's up? We are back, 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 back. I'm trying to stay away from this light. I don't know how, but so kind of way. Okay? Have... okay, I think I got it. This is the table talk, y'all. Let me put my little lipstick oh, on. Let me go blue. I'm going blue. I'm going blue this morning. I'm so, going dark purple this morning. So, guys, I think I should I should do everything at the extreme. So, good morning, Jojo. How are you? I am doing wonderful. Bless God. Okay. Mm -hmm. I am grateful. Please share the live, everybody. Invite your friends. We are here with this unique topic. A lot of us been asking this question it's about time that we come together and share ideas and let each other know what's really going on what's the cause of all of these things happening in our relationships in co-shipping in um marriages and everything but anyway welcome to the let's talk about it with muku and uh Jojo uh, uh, online and this is our table talk with muku and jojo we are here this morning this is the breakfast the break Saturday morning breakfast talk. Of <laughs> so guys, don't hesitate to follow us on all our social media platforms, including our YouTube channel. If you see it was just pop up, including our YouTube channel. And uh, you know, guys, be a blessing if you can. We're not forcing you if you feel you can give our start to be a blessing to people out there. You are most welcome, you know. So this is the table talk, share the live. And if you want to be a part of it, no problem. Tell us we can bring you on. And we can start from there. So we love you guys. Good morning, Jojo. And this is your girl, the one and only, the original, the original, the original, Muko Lomagu, the lion. I know. There you go, the lion, the lion, the lion. <laughs> <laughs> that's the that's the meaning of my name, the Agu, it meaning lion, lion of hey. the of Julia. So that's there you go. Lion. So the lion is here. Let's let's get this thing going. Share the live broadcast. Invite your friends. Share in your different groups, and let's get it going, Jojo. This is the topic today. Let me put put this topic on the screen, and let's see what's happening here. So go ahead, Jojo, and uh, we're here. Yeah, the topic here is you know, uh, uh um. The topic here is what causes your partner to cheat to cheat in the relationship. Ha 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 ha. Ma 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 everybody come on. And when I put the topic on, everybody was like, damn, this is a hot topic. So, guys, if you know it's a hot topic, make sure you're on here and share the video. Share the live broadcast. And we apologize. Last week we had a a uh, a uh, a uh, a uh, uh, funeral service in Maryland, so everybody had to travel. One of our sister expired, and she had to be buried that weekend. So that's the reason why um a lot of us was not on. So we had to switch, you know, do whatever. So this is the live broadcast, and you are welcome, everybody. And I'll mute myself while JoJo start. Yes, why uh, people cheat in marriage, but I. For me, I feel like there are a lot of uh, 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 reasons why. But I feel like one of the main reasons is getting in a relationship not for the right reason. I feel that's the reason. Because if you get into a marriage for the right reason, you will not cheat. A marriage is something where you're getting with someone to spend the rest of your life with. You're getting with someone for a better of what? For, to tell, do your part. So if you are not getting in a marriage for that reason, you're getting in there for any other reason, it might cause you to cheat. Okay, so if you get it in there for that reason and you love that person, no matter what you guys will stick in it, take in death. But if you are not in there for those reasons that I named, it will cause you to do other stuff. Other things will discourage you, will make you want to run out to go do things you're not supposed to do. Okay, some people get in it for papers. Some people get in it just because they want to prove that they're married. Some people get in it because they want someone to care for them. But if you get in the marriage for the reason of marriage, 
to spend the rest of your life with that person, to death do your part, to forsake all others, to death do, uh, to death do your part, to love the person unconditionally, there will be no reason why you will cheat. Okay. Okay, Jojo, let's do this. It's not only marriage, right? Anybody, if you're watching us, just say good morning, you know, so we can acknowledge your presence. So, Yasa Roberts, good morning, gorgeous lady. Good, good morning, good, good morning, my beautiful morning. sister. Welcome. So, so uh, Jojo, let us not just focus on marriages, right? We talk about yeah. relationships. And I always come here and say, I got, a, I got a group that I'm part of. We always talk about, you know, relationship. We always talk about these things. Let me take on the glasses for a minute. So, we always talk talk about these things right we argue be like oh why people cheat and a lot of times in africa our african brothers feel that women cheat on them because they are broke because they don't have money they leave them because oh this guy don't have money my girlfriend or my wife left me because i didn't have a job or i didn't have money you know a lot of times and a lot of my brothers that i speak to in africa this is why they say oh women like money Women, she left me because of this amount, you know, because of this or that. But there are more to that. There are more to that. I'll tell you one thing. So let's say this. If you're treating your woman like a doormat, where you walk on her anyway, you feel like. You talk to her any kind of way you feel like. Smart talk, you know, like those chicken talks from Liberia. When your wife said, oh, you hear this, you know, the way you talk to your wife. The way you, you care for your wife at home, even if you don't have it. Like the Bible says, little is much when Christ is in it, right? Yes. Love covers everything, right? And the same Bible says you should love your wife. We're not only talking about wife, husband, and wife now. You know, we're talking about significant orders. We're talking about dates. We're talking about all these other things, boyfriend, and girlfriend, and stuff like that. Because there's all of, all of those things are pathway to relationship right so a lot of times men feel because they don't have money most especially our african men feels that because they don't have money that's why their wives leave them and go to another person but they don't mm. realize the way you treat your wife can cause her to love you can cause her to hate you can cause her to not want to be with you and like, like the music said, uh, uh, what's his name? Ira Caddy said, when a woman is fed up, she stopped talking. Then you be like, oh, because I don't have it. That's why my wife is leaving me. So let us not focus on only marriages. Let's focus on, you know, other part of the relationships. So I give it to you and I'll, I'll mute myself. Yeah, I will always start with marriage because when it comes to relationship, it's supposed to be with marriage. But also we're talking about relationship. Even if you're in a relationship where you with the person and you you guys are planning to be together, if you are in a relationship for the right reason, it's the same thing. If you are in a relationship for the right reason, you will not go look. If you love your partner, relationship is not about money. The way you look, and, and most of the time, like what you say, uh, Muku, the ones that don't have money are the ones that are even disrespectful. You, you know what I'm saying? They want to tell you whatever they want to say. And if you say something to them, they'll say, oh, because I don't have it. You don't have it, but then you, 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 you're you not even respectful. You're not loving, you're not caring, okay? The woman, a woman will be with you or a, a man will be with you when you guys able to have your one dollar, two dollars and put it together. The way you guys will love one another and respect one another, money will not matter. Okay? But don't place, you know, a lot of people play that game. You know, they know why, why the, the relationship is falling or why the other person is trying to leave, but then they're trying to find some kind of excuses or put it up because I don't have it now, okay? You don't have it now, but you have to be respectful. You don't have it now. What are you doing since you don't have it? What are you doing for the woman? There are other things to do. They're giving someone money. There are other things to do, Okay. I can't hear you, Moku. You mute. So let me come in here. Let's talk about this, right? Love covers everything, right? 
And I always like me, I like these scriptures where the Bible says we should be submissive and the men should love us and we should respect our husbands and stuff like that. But if you like they say an eye for an eye, give Caesar what belongs to Caesar, right? Yes. Yes. So if you the husband does not respect a lot of times, let me talk on behalf of us and the men can come in. Louis Sano, how are you? Louis say right, but respect or good treatment goes both ways. Uh, exactly. So sometimes the woman will treat you right or the man will treat you right. Let's say when you and a man or a woman first start a relationship, right? And y'all decide to be together. Everything's going good. Everything's going fine, right? You guys love each other, respect each other. Maybe you're dating or you're coach shipping. As soon as you guys get married, boom, you, you start to realize everything changed. Okay, maybe the woman, when she met this man, she was being sexy, wearing her tongs, wearing her short lingerie in the in the house. Like me, I, I don't wear underwear in my house. Why, why am I wearing underwear for? I wear my short pants, you know. Something that will spice your marriage or your relationship, right? Then all of a sudden, as soon as you get married to this man, boom, you say, oh, I already got him. You stop all of those things. Okay. It goes both ways. The way you respect your wife, your wife will respect you. The way you respect your husband, your husband will respect you. If the wife respects you from the start and she realizes that this husband don't, does not respect her or call her name or talk to her differently and she tells him, I don't like this, I don't like this, a lot of times the men raise the beast up in a woman, bring out a beast up in a woman like, oh, okay, I'm with you for all these years. I respect you and I keep telling you this is not right, this is not right. Excuse me excuse me guys excuse me guys i'm sorry this is not right this is not right but yet and stay you're doing it so for that reason she becomes rebellious or he becomes rebellious right it happy in the relationship but then this is our main topic what causes your husband to cheat your boyfriend to cheat your wife to cheat your your husband to cheat so this is a topic that we bring up but we merge it because it's a table talk we will merge it about being long distance, far apart, where you prefer your wife going to cheat with a man or where you prefer your man, your wife using vibrator to make herself feel happy. Let's talk these things. This is the table talk, guys. Come and defend yourself. Come, let's talk about it, women. How we feel in our homes, how we feel in our marriages. Are we being respected? Are we being caring for because a lot of times i talk to my brothers oh that woman left me because i don't have money sometimes it's not the money you was broke when she got married to you or started dating you so why now she will want to leave you sometimes the bedroom is boring too sometimes the woman boring and man boring and when she go out there and somebody say like i said you treat your wife like a doormat and somebody go and say oh my oh pretty you beautiful you can never tell your wife you love her unless you want to be intimate with her you can never look at your wife and say oh my god you are beautiful or when your wife dress you can't even acknowledge the difference if she bleached her hair or she did this or that you cannot acknowledge anything but mind you if you get dressed your wife say, oh baby red right, looking good i like that outfit on you but you can't do it in return so these are all things that turn and bring the marriage to a heart i'm not kidding or bring the relationship to a heart you would be like well i need this attention have they requesting this attention for so long well when you put your foot down they come to themselves after a couple of, 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 of weeks they go back right back to the same thing where you were fussing about so let's talk about it guys welcome louis sando all the way from florida Yeah, like my brother said, you can hear me now. I'm on mute, though. Okay. You hear me now? Mm -hmm. Okay. Like, like my brother said, okay, yes, it goes both ways. Both men and women both do that. And some women, yes, yeah, some women will get in a relationship because of money. And some men will get in a relationship of uh, money. These days... The more than one, those days we used to say, maybe the woman, the man get the money, that's why the woman, but this time, even the men are following the women because of money or what they have, okay? It, it is true, and that's what I said. If you are getting in a relationship for the right reason, you were not. And a lot of this time, this cheating come about self-control. 
We don't have no self-control. Yeah, or, or, or partners together in the other person trouble, maybe just for two months. Two months, a woman don't even want to control herself. She got to take vibrator with her. What, what kind of word is this? That you can't even control yourself for even a month. You know, those are the reasons why people cheat. Because if you can't control yourself at school, of course you're going to see somebody that will be attractive when you will meet and something might happen. A woman or man and you start talking, won't it lead to another? Because you cannot even control yourself for a month, for a week. You know, understand if couples are together and they agree to use those stuff together, that is okay. But we need to stop doing this. Well, or soon the lady broke, uh, the woman and the man, they broke up. You see, a lot of, I hear a lot of sisters say, oh my God, I even care, I got my vibrator. Okay, that's okay if you like it, but okay. Self-control, come on now. Self-control. I can say this, it's almost a year, you know, I've been uh, separated from my husband where I decided, okay, this is it. I'm not going through this. And I decided to be single. I am single by choice. I am legal. I am still legally married and going through divorce, okay? But I decided, no, I'm going through divorce and this is it. I'm going to go through this. So it's almost one year, okay? Next month will make me one year with all sex and with no vibrator. Okay, so you can control yourself because you know what you want, you know what you want, you know what you, you I mean, like the self control is the problem. Self control is the problem. Muku? Yes, so yes, yeah, self control. But the thing is that what causes hi, Deconti, good morning to you as well, honey. I hope you are having a beautiful day. Yes, yeah, so you know what causes a man to cheat on in his what so what do you think, Josh Jojo? What causes a man to cheat or a woman to cheat on, 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 on his wife? People who cheat is in their mind. That's something you want to do. If you don't want to cheat, you will not cheat. I don't care what the situation is. If a man still not ready, if a woman or man not still ready to be in a committed relationship or ready to stay away from other people, they will find any reason to cheat. If your mind is not on it, you will not do it. Okay? Not, not because the person did not treat you right or whatever. That's the reason why you should cheat. If you cheat, it's because you want to cheat. Okay, like I said, I always set the example on something that I know about. Okay, I was in my relationship at the end, things were not working well. I didn't like situation. Yes, there are men coming after me every day. I didn't say every other day from morning to night. Okay, but it cost me to cheat. I can cheat whenever I want. And even with me being separated from my husband, that when, when I say separated, when I decided, okay, this is it, I'm not having sex with you anymore. It, it, it's, you know, in almost a year, okay? I could have go and sleep with someone. I talk to, you know, people talk to me all the time. People in my inbox all the time. People love me. I sleep or I stay by myself because I want to. But if my mind is on sex, mm -hmm. if that's what I want to do, ain't mm -hmm. nothing. Because if this things to me, that will make me to say, okay, I want to go and do it. But if I do it, that means that's what I want to do. But I don't want to be someone like that. So sex is something that your mind on, and that's what you want to do. Ain't no reason, no one make you to cheat. You want to cheat. So then your best bet is if you have a partner who's cheating on you and you know and have or or evident that this partner is cheating on you or have cheated on you, then what the essence of being in marriage or the relationship? Then get exactly. out. Sorry for cut. You want to continue? Go on, no, honey. Go ahead. No, go ahead. Let's talk. Exactly. But I would tell you for me, I am a very spicy person. This is where, like I always say when I come on the show, I'm I, you know Jojo can say hey, Muku, but I'm a realist. I, I like to be real. I love <laughs> to put let's put That's the way let, life should be. I, I, I like let's put away the Christianity side. Let's put away. I'm a Christian, I'm a believer, a, 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 a one man to one woman. Let's put away that. Let's put away your bed is in divine. So if your husband is divine, your bed, then you can you got to sit down and wait till you get divorced. Let's put all of that thing there aside. But me in my typical life, if I have a boyfriend or husband who's cheating on me, I will give you the same damn medicine so you feel how it, so you can feel how cheating on your girlfriend or your wife can be. If you do it once. I might try to consider you 
You understand? When you come back with all sincerity. But if you decide that I want to be there, me, I'm not going to be like my mother or my grandmother was say, oh, because of my children, I will stay in a marriage or because I'm married, the Bible say, for better or for worse. And then the Bible say, oh, if your wife is one thing, men, let me tell you about men. That's the only scripture in the Bible, most especially the Christian, the believers, the pastors. They play that on women's mind and tell them, well, the Bible says when a man is unfaithful or a woman is unfaithful, divorce her. But why they should divorce a woman? Then a the woman will remain unmarried, but the man will go get married. But let me come in for something you just said. I will pay my debt. I will pay my dad. Let me just say something. Listen to me because I don't want to be the one fighting for that divorce. I don't want to be the one that say, oh, I left my marriage because my husband cheated on me. So I will pay my dad. Then you will go tell the people my wife cheated on me. Then the people will ask you why your wife cheated on you. Then you will. Okay, let me, let me then come in. Then I will go to the Moses law and eye for an eye. Liberian men say men medicine, that like men. I'm real. Okay. Let me but come in there. Uh, Malachuka can look at me in a kind of way. That's it. Malachuka, welcome. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> no, let me come in there to what you just said. Okay. Oh. I will come around and let me just tell you. And that's the reason why good people become bad people. Because you allow another person to change who you are. That man that you think did that to you, you make yes. that man. You make that man to control you. Let me finish. You make that man to control you. You make that man to change who you are. You become that man and chill and put your personality down. You have to have your self-control and respect for yourself to not allow anyone to change you to become them. Okay? You can say somebody like to steal and you go and steal. Now, if the person cheat on you and you don't like it, pay back is this. You walk away and move on with life. But for you to follow what the person is doing, that means you allow the person to control you. It means you don't have Go control second. of yourself. You have, to be control. you have to be in control Go of second. yourself. No matter Go how second. you take it, it Go means second. you have to change yourself and become somebody else. Josephine, you're not changing me. A part of me, Jaha, a part of you. You're not changing me. Yeah, you cannot teach old dog new tricks. The person you cheated because the person cheated on you, right? Hold oh, on, no. Jojo, listen to me, Jojo, listen. You're not listening. You're not listening, Jojo. But listen, right? This is where it becomes very interesting. I'm not lying to you. I tell people, I tell my relationship, when I'm still communicating with you, you say have a chance. But when I keep fire, do you know what it is to want to be loved? I guess you have experienced not being loved by somebody you love, by somebody you call your own. Do you know what it is to not be, be given the attention sometimes you need that attention sometimes you need that care sometimes you need somebody to just tell you how beautiful of a person you are you just need somebody to tell you how wonderful god has made you and women you know how we were created we are very soft people person and when we are in a, a vulnerable stage and we meet somebody who gave us the attention. We go for that attention. One, let me tell you, you think, why is it? In the Christian setting, when you are an evangelist, they can do not encourage you to go and evangelize to a woman behind closed door by yourself. Why do you think that? Why you think that? Why? So this is what happened. If I need love and attention from my partner, he's not giving it to me. Jojo, I'm not lying to you. Or we all will meet at Jerusalem, the foot of God, and say, Father, forgive me. Or you know, one thing I like about the Bible, the only thing, my crown will not be glittering on my head. But even in my last breath, if I just say, Father, in the name of Jesus, forgive me, I'm forgiven right there. All sins are equal. The only reason why people talk about sexual immorality is because it's within the body and the spirit of God lives in the body. And I know no sin go unpunished. I know God will punish me. He said, no sin go unpunished. He will punish me. But I stay, he said, I am a just God. I am a faithful God. He does not reward us according to our sins, neither to according to our iniquity. We all know the Bible, but we will meet to Jerusalem, the foot of God, and say, Father, forgive me. Because if, <laughs> you, make me, if you make me to feel less of a woman, if you make me to feel less of a person and you treat me as your wife, significant other, girlfriend, fiance, like a doorman, and I go out there and a man treats me like a woman, eh? 
It's the same. If you treat your husband, your boyfriend like a doormat at home, you don't respect him, you disrespect your man, what do you expect? If he go out there, a woman bring water for him and say, babe, I know you had a long day or you just woke up this morning, this is your cup of coffee. Give the cup of coffee, he drinks it, and this is a continuing process in a month, he will go for it. But one thing I would tell anybody, if you're in that relationship, get out. Get out. Me. You do me, I do you. I will do it. When we reach to Jesus' feet, we will apologize. I'm for real. The pastors are watching me. My friends, my brothers and sisters are watching me. I'm a, real, I'm a realist. I tell you as it is. So you can look at me at any way. And one thing I know you're going to tell the people, say my wife cheated on me. One question will ask you, what did you do to her? And if I tell you to go my no no, you don't want to do my no no. I'm a I only woman be doing your your your, your titty titty. And I fair. If I go out there and somebody can do it better than you, I will flow. Are you kidding me? Yes, yes Jojo. Like like you said, everyone have a different mindset, you know, the way you think about it, the way you look at it, the way you feel about it, I do feel about it different. And like you said, if you make me feel like a door mark or whatever, no man, I mean, absolutely, no man make me feel like a door mark. You might do whatever you want to do. You okay. might say, I will never look at it as well. Take a That's break, Take a break, Muku. Take a break, Muku. Take a break, take a break. Can you can you get a fan over there? Let the fan blow you. Take a break. No man, absolutely no man will make me feel like a doma. Let me tell you, you can do whatever you want. If I feel it's not right, I'm walking away. Okay, I will not stay in it, but you will not make me to be you. I will never allow any man to make me to be you. Just because you cheated on me, that's in me, I should go and cheat on you. I will respect myself, I will guard myself, and you will be the loser. You will be the loser because I will step away and walk away and move on with life. But I, I think I don't think it's okay. And let me tell you, like you said, I will go to with it. They see Bible tell us if you know it is, you know it's wrong. You you talking to God, you know, okay, let me just go to where I will come and say sorry. That's one of the bad ones. Well, you, know you, know you, you know how many pastors you know how many pastors have committed sin and they know sin is wrong. You know how many pastors have committed sin and they know, and sin I know is and wrong? that doesn't make it right either. That doesn't Would make you? it right either. That you know how many of them for me, and we I all are sinners. Good and like good I good. said, the children, we all good are sinners. We all look at it different, like you said. Like you see, I, I feel like you, you, you're right in another sense. If someone to you, you can do you. But everyone, like I said, everyone in a different mindset. I don't like no one to import what uh, 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 what the two on me. I will not. So if you think you're doing something to get to me, no. I'm not, I'm not like what you did. I don't like what you did or the things you are doing. But that doesn't mean you're going to bring me down. No. My self-esteem so hard. I don't know who it took on earth to bring it down. I am so high on that. I respect myself and I got my DNA. So don't think you will just you will do something and say you just respect me. Yeah, you just respect and I don't like it. You can do it, but I don't have to accept it. Mm -hmm. Or make it be very disrespectful or cheating on a woman. Yes, the man will do it. Of course, the man will do it. But you don't have to accept or you don't have to allow it. And that's one of the reasons why I fight for divorce. Because if I feel like it's not okay and I give it a chance and I give it a chance and I give it a chance and I see like you're not going to change, I will walk away. But I will not let you to make me to do what I'm not supposed to do. Because uh -uh. character... Your character is you. People will say, oh, who is this guy? I want to say, you say something. Say, oh, no, 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 that's not Josephine. Because you have to go with your character. Right, and if you want what the man do, Josephine, you're going Josephine, to continue Josephine. to do it. Yeah. Let me come in. When we talk about character, I'm not going to do it with multiple men. Trust me, I will be my devil. Let's let's welcome, on, on. let's let's welcome let's welcome our viewer first. You know, we got Chica on on here. We got your uh, we got what her name Yasa on here. We got Louis Sandler from Florida is here. We have uh, uh Deconti is here. One thing Deconti that one Deconti is my list is stuff for real. Deconti say I will pay my dad. Are you there? Pay your dad. Let him feed the same thing you feed. Muku, let's start. So, let's start got, from all the comments. Wait. Let's start from the comments. Let's start discussing little comments for now. Okay, before okay, the let's, two months. okay let's put that. Let's start from the beginning, now. please. Let's put Louis Sandler here. Say right, but respect our. We did we did Louis already. Okay, we did this. So we got Chica Chica here. She said people cheat because they want to cheat. Nobody has the ability to make a person cheat or not to cheat. That's true. You don't have the ability to make me not to cheat. 
Exactly. You don't have the ability to make me cheat. That she okay. said, I mm -hmm. can walk away. I will walk away. You will be the loser. That's the reason why when I get into a relationship, I give my hundred percent. Okay. Well, if I walk, walk away, if I walk away, I tell you, if I walk in away, I'm going to sit and put my hand crap crap. Boy, would he cry? While I'm walking away, I'm going to find my own too. Of course, walk away for your own. That's what I'm talking about, girl. But don't stay in there and do it. Walk away and for your own. That's the right uh, way to do it. Okay, then. What's the next comment? The next comment here. Sometimes on 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 met needs what a physical or emotional leads order to find comfort elsewhere. Of course, that's what I said. You know. You're not getting the treatment at home. You're not getting the love at home. You're not getting whatever that is desired as a woman or a man to be treated fairly. So definitely, if you go out there, like I said, you got a woman bringing your tea or your coffee to drink. You got a man telling, baby, how was work today? Oh, how you doing this and that? And it's a continuous process. I'm not saying the one I can just come to pretend now. You will sense that this person really like you. And one thing I tell you, if I leave another relationship, I am not going into another one explaining why I left that one. It's in here. I'm keeping it to myself. So definitely, I will know if you are right, if you are the right person or you, you are sincere in whatever it is. So that was definitely, definitely what you said. It is. Dakota, what you said, it is it is okay that I agree with you, but before that person find comfort somewhere else, they should walk away from the one they are. If that one not working for you, why should you stay in it and find comfort in another person? And then, and then you, you, go in, you go in in between. Just walk away from the one that is not giving you that comfort Good and find a comfort. Jojo, sometimes a lot of women in marriages, right? Let's talk about the marriage. For a boyfriend and girlfriend, you can just leave fiance on but I just lay away business. You can get dusty on the shelf so you can leave. But, <laughs> but let's talk about marriage. A lot of times people stay in the marriage. Well, let me see this here. Let me try to work on it. I think we had a conversation before. You working on it the first year, gone. No change. The second year, gone. No change. The tear year going no change because you desire that marriage. You desire that person. You want that marriage to work. And when you look, you're not still 12, 13 years in your time gone. You'll be like, some women will be like, Oh, I already not stay in a relationship yet. Get out. We gotta say in Liberia, if the heat is too much in the kitchen, get out. Don't stay that till you suffocate. That thing, emotional abuse that's something. And me, I defy myself to ever go through that book. BS again. So let's go to uh, the next comment here. They're going to say, yeah, we, we went through that. And uh, this show is spicy today. Very spicy. Yeah, me and my partner will own it. Head to head today. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. uh, but you head to head today. Hold on. Jenny said, hey, hey, I am enjoying your... I am enjoying your... Hold on. So yeah, then then go ahead with a comment. Uh, uh, read the comments too, okay? So uh, uh, and then, hold on, let me go. Jack to the next. said, "Everyone wants to feel valued and respected in their relationship. That is so true. If you don't feel valued or respectful or respected in that relationship, walk out. You have no reason to be in it. No reason to be in it. Walk out." If you want to make it work, try your best and make it work. If you think you can make it work, then get out. Okay? But don't let no one to make you to be who you're not. Okay. We do another one here. Uh, uh, what, what she say here? She gonna say, hmm, I like how you can manage the you can you can migrate the Bible inside my mamuku oluma ya or preach it. I will preach it, man. I will preach. I will tell you again that all I know the Bible yeah. But here we've been practical. We've been practical. This is this is secular side now. We're on the secular side. We're not on the gospel side right now. And what her niece say? Say what go? When she say, "Oh Lord, this woman, yeah, what I mean, as I am, that's how I come, as I am." But y'all will be amazed. I'm very soft on the on the inside. <laughs> y'all not see me that I can be very soft. Yes, and um, uh, Jojo, I am with you. Uh, I'll definitely you will be with Jojo anyway. So you will be with Jojo. Have you <laughs> jumping over some of them though? No, I ain't jump over nobody. Decoty after Decoty said after we, I think. Is it Dakonti? Yeah, that's Dakonti. After we chocolate, 
We were me at a pop. We me and I was I were me at a ma. I said it. I saw chocolate with me at a four at Jerusalem. And I was said, and I would tell you, I can tell somebody it's your girl. Okay, why you think they're flesh and blood now? Why you think flesh and blood? Yeah. Okay, so just leave massa at the bottom, right? Put massa on up. Hold on, we we coming down, we coming down, we coming down. Okay, uh, massa, Jojo, I'm with you. Okay, uh, uh, let's go to massa. Mm -hmm. Chica is my girl. So, uh, 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 let's go to massa. Yeah, massa coming right there. I'm trying to respond to somebody trying to. Okay. Um, Okay, Massa said I'm cheating. Trying to I'm trying to respond to your brother-in-law. Yeah, he trying. <laughs> cheating is connected. It a habit, and there's nothing no one can do to stop it unless the person themselves decides to stop it and work and work on themselves. It's a choice, but not all men cheat. It is so true, my son. You are so true. It is so true. It is a choice. Whenever you decide to do it, it means you want to do it. I don't like that excuse that people make, or even my partner making. It. It's because the person did it, so I would pay my damn going to do it. No, if you do it, it means you want to do it. No one make you to cheat. Even if someone cheats, that doesn't mean you should cheat. No one make anyone to cheat. You cheat because you want to cheat. If you if someone cheating on you, you don't like it, and you know the person not going to stop, and you don't want to be in it, stay in it. For those of you who think you have to stay with the man, whether he cheat or whether he disrespect you, you got to prove to the world that you have been married for 50 years. You got to prove that you are a married woman. You got to prove that in your family, you the one who keeping marriage. You got to prove that in your family, nobody can divorce. You want to stay in it, stay in it. That's your problem. That's your choice. Okay. Hey, Adair, Kamara, how are you? If you Welcome. know that you value yourself, that's what the Bible says. It. The Bible says that's what. That's the one reason the Bible says a person can walk away from a, a marriage. Because you know what it is? Sleeping, having sex, intercourse with another person. That's taking a whole nother spirit and bringing it into your home. That is just not okay. It's not okay, but... Once I get in order A, it will be okay. It will be okay. Now, that just says, like yes. I said, everyone's different. It will be okay. Let me show my lip first. Hey, Dara, <laughs> welcome. Welcome to the show. This is our table talk. You are free. Welcome, welcome. Dara. This is your first time, but welcome. You are free to come in. If you want, anybody who wants to come on, you want to appear on the show, this is the table talk. This is the table talk. We we talk different things. We you know we come up with a topic, but then we merge into other things. That's why I have you on of the course. table talk when you're drinking coffee or you're drinking your tea and you just bring up things. You know, I might come up to say, "Oh, Jojo, what do you think about Governor or uh, a uh, team signing a paper for our children and to change their sex?" What do you think? You know, we can bring any topic, anything we feel the need to talk. But one thing we don't talk about is politics, most especially African politics. We don't talk about it because it brings segregation. So our show is for politics. But we talk about parenting. We talk about relationships. We talk about marriage. We talk about sex and everything else. Yep, so Darius, if you have any comments, you can put out a comment on that. We will discuss it. Your comment is never wrong, you know, because we all think different. We all act different. We all understand things different. We will talk about it. Everyone can take that side or whatever. We just try to bring all points, you know, that we feel is best. But you are welcome to say anything that once you are respectful, that would be great. You are welcome, Matthew. We are glad to have you on as well. Thanks for being a part of this show. Welcome. So now, if you feel that you don't want your wife. Is that a oh, comment yeah. reading? Yes. So, um, <laughs> so let's talk about this, right? Let's talk about the long distance thing now. Last week, we talked about Pelosius, right? Is that what that is that a similar name? <laughs> Whatever we buku, you got me cracking up today. Oh my god! <laughs> so is that a civilized name? But anyway, last week we talk about we talk about week before last we talk about 
sex toy right when your partner is not around we talk about sex toy we talk about masturbation and like i told jojo i said a pastor said that a, a pastor said this is the table talk we got different topics that we talk about so a pastor said that at least we have argued about you know why men cheat why women cheat so now on the table talk we come up with one topic and after that topic guess what happened we come up with another topic. We come up with stuff. Like last week, the topic was very, very interesting. So a lot of people say we should go on over it again. So, and we talk about sex store. We talk about women using sex store. We talk about, you know, I remember talking to a pastor about that. And she was like, once you and your partner decide that you're going to use it, but a lot of African men feel it's an abomination. A lot of African men feel that if you bring that sex store in your bedroom, that means you, 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 but you have to spice the relationship, right? Then our pastor wife, uh, 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 Pastor Colley wife said to us, how will you feel if you walk on your husband having sex with a uh, sex doll? So Jojo said when she knew that thing, it can just make her body be <laughs> Yeah, that's just a whole nother so, thing. All these things. So my question is, if you are not around, and your husband is not around. Let's say you've traveled or your husband lives out of the country. Will you prefer your wife to go and cheat on you or your girlfriend to go and cheat on you then for her to use a sex toy? Or oh, Matthew got some comments here. Let me see. Oh, that's uh cheating back does not change the fact that you were cheated on and it hurts more if you cheat back because you live with that but the thing about it if i'm cheating and i mean i'm leaving you i'm leaving you i don't want you again i don't want you again we might be under the same roof for it but it would just be for a matter of time you know it would be a matter of time just stop laughing oh, I, 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 I know you're laughing. I, I know you're laughing. You I of it. Cheat on you that mean i don't want you i would just be there trying to maintain you or trying to, to to like you know i would just be there what what's the word you know trying to deal with you till my plans can go in force because if i'm going to cheat on my husband if i can tell anybody if i have sexual relationship all of my marriage that mean i don't want that me so we might be in the same house. I would just don't, you know, I would just play it like it is till my decision is made and I do what I got to do or uh, 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 massa. So definitely, you know, I know it will hurt because you stay with that person or whatever. But if I'm cheating on you and we're in the same house, you know, I don't want you. I don't want you. Mm -hmm. Massa, you are so right, okay? You are so right. I want me and my partner with all day today on this topic. We're going to hit one another heart on this topic. Yeah. The thing you say, you guys will be under the same roof, under the same roof. And uh, uh, like you're saying, there are a lot of people who do it. They pay their debt, they're under the same roof. And then they will still be having sex with the husband. So, what I'm trying to say is, you make your, you allow to your husband to change who you are or whoever it is. You cannot. So, what can you just get out of the relationship before doing it? Because it still don't, doesn't make it okay. Okay. It means you allow, no matter how you put it, partner, no matter how you put it, that person make you to become who you're not. No matter how you put the partner, you make that person to control you. Because that cheating you did, you did it because the person did it. So, you pay there. That means you make the be allowed to person to change who you are and i would never ever allow anyone to make me to do what i'm not anything you do is on you so partner if you go you cheat on that it's because you wanted to cheat that's what you cheat okay so it's not because the person cheated on you the person cheated on you and walk away you don't have to stay in it and do it no you don't what would that do for you they won't do anything you know walk away it hurts it even hurts more when the person cheat on you and you tell them okay what you did is not going to work for me. I'm out. And they will not even believe that you're going to get out of it for that. And you walk out and move on. It even hurts more than doing it for your own. And you cheat the hell out of your life. No, we're not arguing about that thing, partner. Me, you're not arguing because you cheated. I cheated. We're not arguing on that thing. I'm going to make it my I want to ask you, Moku. So say mm -hmm. you're going to cheat. Are you going to cheat for the person to know? Or are you going to sneak and do it? Ma, I, I don't. If you cannot sneak and go do it, I can see it, and you make me to know. I'm not coming to you and tell you say I cheated today. Oh, I, I, I just want to let you know that today I went outside. I go sleep. Yeah, 
you don't want to do you you do jam i'm a woman i'm a fbi investigate more than the fbi like you do your own investigation no, but Muku, investigate i'm not going to announce to you i'm not going to announce to you they were not cheating for you to see it they were cheating okay, okay i'm not Next coming to you to me say something the question i'm asking you is this mm -hmm. listen to the question and answer me right back now. i mm -hmm. know you are hot but I mean, if I wish I were close to you so I could put some, you know, cold tower on your chest or something, you know. I am talking about the person were hiding it from you, but now you caught them cheating, okay? Mm -hmm. And now you're going to pay your debt. So mm -hmm. now you are set going to sneak. So you're just going to be sneaking until they, no. they catch you too? Yeah, you feel you want to for it, you catch it, you catch it. But every time I want to go to it, I will go do it. So if the person didn't catch you, you're just going to be in there having sex with a man and having sex with the other person. Just no, I will, I, like I will not be doing sex with two persons. That's what I say. If I'm cheating now, if I decide to sleep out of my marriage or out of my relationship, that means I'm not sleeping with you anymore. So then why you stay in the same, you're not going to go back that your house? That's what I said previously. I said we will be in the same house that I can put everything together and be able to leave. I can't jump out today. I say, okay, I'd rather do it. I put my clothes in. Yes, you should end it. Hey. You should let him know. You but, should end it. You, will, I'm out. you don't you have to walk up. You can you let the person know. know you're done. But if the you, person feel like you stay in a relationship, you're not in a relationship. If you are in a relationship, you're not sleeping with your partner. Then that relationship there. You know that like it's over. And you will tell them, I don't want to have sex with you. I'm done with you. You know it's over. Because there's no, no woman that still love a man. There's that. No, Jojo, there's no woman that still love a man. Will be laying on next to that man and don't want to sleep with that man or don't want to touch that man. And there's yes, no man that will be there's be no like man. That. There's no man that will lay near his wife or his, his girlfriend and he love his girlfriend and don't touch his girlfriend. You That's understand? Not true. So Moku, I, I don't agree to that. When I decided really? to did not want to have sex with my husband, I still I was still in love with him, but I did I felt like I but love you not the love was gone. The love was not there anymore. No, no, Moku, that's not true. If you can love someone and make decisions, okay. When you two that love someone, you will always love them. I will always love my husband, but I can I gotta walk off for the best of myself. So I still love him when I decided that I don't want to have sex anymore. I'm done. That doesn't mean I don't love him anymore. No. If you love someone, the love is there. But I, I, I felt like, okay, this is it. And I don't matter what he did. It's not like you were asking me and wanted it, and I was refusing to give it to you. It's not like I didn't love you. I, I still love you, but I still I decided, no, nope, I'm going to respect myself. So no, as much as I love you, you ain't even going to touch the thing anymore. You ain't going yeah. to eat that sweet, sweet thing anymore. It's gone. <laughs> it's going to lay right here. You're never going to touch it. And that's how yeah. much it holds. Because it yeah. would be that you will not touch it. So it's not like well, I, I when I you, go more in front, I and me, I don't love you. No, I, I still love you, not, but I have to make the right I, decision for myself. When they, when they talk about this, I don't like to say decisions, right? Because it has condition. But if I choose to sleep with another man, that means I don't want my marriage anymore. So even if you say that you have to different way. get out before you I do would, something. Get, yes. Oh, for get you, out. For you, no, get you, out. For you to cheat, for you to sleep with someone when your partner don't know that the relationship is over, hold on, that's hold on. cheating. Jojo, hold on. I'm trying to join. I can send you a link. All you need to do, uh, I can send you a link to join. So if you're trying to just join, this is not like a regular broadcast. So, uh, Darren, I can send you the link. So just give me a couple of minutes and then you can come on, okay? So just give me a couple of minutes. Jojo, you can go air. Masa, air, air. tell some people, Masa, come here on. Masa is ready. I love Masa. I put Masa, Masa on air. I, I love a sister who interacts. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So hold on. Uh, while you guys talk, I will mute myself and try to put Darren on the line. Okay. Okay. I will at read least, her comments. At least it's a guy, so we want him to come on. Okay. Now, Masa said, if you cheat back and just be there on the same roof, then that's where physical abuse, verbal abuse, and emotional abuse start to occur, and it's not a good place to be. Thank you, sister. Like I said, like for my situation, my husband and I have a home. We bought a home together. So of course, I have three children, three children from uh, 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 from my last relationship that my husband passed away. So I have my three children that are not my husband's biological children. And my husband and I have the, we, we, we have a home. So I'm staying in the home. He stay in the home, but he does a job where he is in a hotel or the party in a hotel where he did so he comes 
Whenever he comes and grab whatever or sleep the night or two now, whatever time he wants to come, he comes, he goes downstairs in the basement. We're in the same hall. I'm upstairs. He come whenever, you know, he come whenever. Yesterday he came back. You know, he come whatever. But you know, I upstairs, he downstairs with pass to say hi and whatever. And I tell make so uh you guys can still be in the same room, but you have guys have to make it uh, make one another understand that you know what we're here until we can get the room to settle. This is it. And then we're okay, we're in the home until we can get it to the court system and sell it. What are we going to sell the house? What are you going to own a home? What I'm going to own a home until we can get to the court system, the relationship, we're done. So you guys can be in the same relation, in the same home and make it out. You guys can understand that, you know, it's over with. And when you made up your mind, and that's the thing that makes some people, you are not respected by your partners. You have to be very careful with the way you make decisions. And a lot of the time, that's the reason why men or women don't respect the other person, because you keep making decisions that you don't keep. So before you make a decision, you have to be very careful before you make a decision. You don't want to make a decision, and the person talk to you, and you let it go the first time, and then the next time, again, you make the same decision, and they talk to you, let it go again, you keep doing it, keep doing it. That person will not, they will not care because they know that's what you're always going to do. You're always going to accept and cheating and they come in. So people, so women never going to leave their, their marriage. Though as, as much as the husband cheated on and the cussing noise in our ears and, and, and saying a whole lot of things and calling other women and abusing them and telling them or, or uh, expressing ourselves how the person is part their marriage, they're not going to leave the man. They're still going to stay in it. And when your husband or your partner know that, they, they're not going to stop because they know you're not even, to, you're not respecting yourself to leave the situation. That is an emotional abuse. Everything in this abuse for you to be in a relationship and sitting in there and the person is sleeping all over the place and you think it is not even a marriage anymore. Because what makes a marriage is the vow for sick or others. So you just there. You're just mistreating one another. So hey, if you want to be on the record that you've been married for 50 years, that's okay with you. You know? And I tell you, those who have been in their marriages for 50, 30 years, yes, they have been going through a lot of stuff. Yes, it's not easy. Marriage is not an easy thing because two people that are coming from different families coming together, it is not an easy thing. Of course, you will go through a, a, a lot of things. But sleeping around with other people is not something that should be happening so, in uh, a marriage. So, so, Jojo, I just, uh, I just posted, I just, Darren, I just, Darren, I just sent you the link so you can follow the prompt if you want to come on. So, yes, we're talking about cheating, right? But uh, I know a lot of times when we talk about cheating in relationship, we think it's only sexual immorality. So let's talk about time. Let's talk about care and let's put everything on the table. Do we consider that as cheating on your wife or your husband, not giving any care, not paying attention to your wife or your husband and all of that and, you know, disrespect and the way the man or the woman talk to you? Let's include that now on the topic. And uh, we got some uh, uh, stuff here. So Matthew say, thanks for adding me to we read that already, right? Somebody so put up, you had a comment that you just took up. You had a comment there first. Which one? That was my you, No, that was someone else for why they said why the beginning was it started from why uh, 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 why cheat if you okay, I'll look for it. Just give me a minute. Yeah, that why cheat when you are still married. Exactly. Mm -hmm. Whoever may I just remember it. Why cheat? Yes, yeah, so you okay, I'll, I'll, okay, I think it's all the way down. So let me just put the comments and then keep going down. Okay, turn I just added you, Matthew says here. Thanks for adding me. And then we just keep going down. I, I get him out of the marriage or relationship why mm -hmm. most are not love. Yes. Uh okay. Uh, okay. Thank okay. I cannot make that comment again. Yeah, I didn't understand it. I get, I get it out it. of the marriage or relationship where I think she meant to say where most where I'm not loved. So if you are not being loved in the relationship, she's gonna be getting out of the relationship. Okay, and, yeah. Uh, yeah, yeah that's if you don't feel you, favor, you are Thank right. You, that you if just you don't feel love, get out, get out. Okay, yeah. you deserve to be loved. And let me tell you, sometimes men want to compare themselves in the way where women bring it down, whatever. What do you think? God had to put you to sleep to make woman. Men, you mm -hmm. ever woman. Hmm. You ever us. You think you can cheat woman, 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 woman. woman. If you know 
how valuable you are. You will never make a man to mistreat you. That's the reason why God put men to sleep before he made woman. You have a woman. When a woman know what she owns, what she has, her worth. <laughs> thank you. Matthew says, thank you that you just spoke about you sleeping out of your marriage. It is not godly since you refer to the Bible. We know it's not godly though. We know it's not godly. <laughs> she, she, she already said it. She I said, said it. I said it's not godly, but I'm just being spicy and I'll pay my debt. Yes. And like I told her, I said, it's very wrong for her to do that. She can get out of the marriage. I, 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 like I said, I'm, I'm an example of it. I've been, I, I, I'm going through divorce right now. Okay. When I decided, like I said, when I decided to stay, Stay away sexually from my husband. Next month gonna make me one year, and I have not slept with anyone or my husband, and I have not used my breaker. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm very proud of myself. And let me tell you, I got people embarrassing me all day and want to take me off for dinner. Even my brother want to do that. I got men coming at me like this, but I'm having self control. Okay, so, uh, I'm saving myself self control. That's what I am. So yeah, he said you guys are changing the topic on the table talk. We don't stick to one topic. That's why the table we, talk. That's why bring table us something talk. and we will talk we, about we, it. We talk about anything. We talk about anything that comes to mind. Most especially when we look at the the comments on our viewer, we we add. So last week topic was about you know all these masturbation and other stuff. So we decided to merge it today with the cheating topic. So on our platform, we do not only stick to one topic a day. Sometimes we do ten different topics. Thank you. Cheating back does not change the fact that you were okay. We read that before. That was Massa. And then Matthew here, he said, Let's stick on to this topic, people. No, actually, everything that we're talking but about. I, but Matthew says something, something so we can discuss. If you want us to stick on the topic, mm -hmm. you guys will make us to stick on the topic by bringing uh comments that we will discuss. That's why we go through the comments. Because if you say about something about today's comment uh topic, then we will keep talking about it. But when you guys don't talk, then we will stop because it's table talk. Okay, if the other one is getting cool, we're gonna put something on the table that is going to be hot. So let's see what you say again. Why are you African ladies changing to the Western culture that you people are complaining about in recent times? Mm. Can you give us an example? Can you give no, no, no. an example? Of so what you're complaining you know, about? Something you want to I don't know what you're talking about. We are not changing, but you have to tell us what it is because what? Let me go back to him. Your African men mm. want to treat women like they are dogmas. So that is nothing. Then you don't want to change what you're complaining you because you don't want a woman, you don't want a woman to tell you who she is. You don't mm. want a woman to let you to know that you have to respect. Oh, don't That you are African man. You're not supposed to clean the house. You think you are African man. You're not supposed to go to the church the PTA meeting. You think you are African man. You're not supposed to make breakfast for your children. Who you guys think you are? Then when you see the women this time that no value of themselves and start to tell you, you have to help me clean the house. You have to help me take the children. And you think we have, we're coming over to uh, uh, another culture. Yes, you better well, take again. Because we know what our if, woman if is. If you see that a woman is coming over a Western culture, then let's go to the African culture while a woman stay home and be yes. a full time mom. And you yes. go to work. You're not supposed to work. Matthew, do you have a woman? Is the woman working? Because she's supposed to be home for you to take care of her. Because she's supposed to be home. So if she's working and you're working, you should help her clean the house. So Matthew, give us an example. Let's hit the and topic. Has, because we have to in Africa, so a lot of women, I don't know if if it's happening now, in Africa, a lot of women don't have anything to say when a man doing wrongs to them. And a lot of times, even in the U.S., when a man is doing wrong and a woman try to tell you, this is what you're doing, I don't like it, you need to stop to tell you, you're complaining, you nag yes. too much, you like to talk too much. Then they refer you, oh, you want to be like the Western women, you want to be like the white women. We are precious. We were wonderfully made. We are your precious gifts. That's why the Bible says, let's go back to the Bible. Like my mother says, she like when I go to the Bible. Let's go back to the Bible. The Bible says, husband, love your wife as Christ loved the church. Do you know how Christ loved the church? Hey! He loved the church. Do you know he how Christ loved, loved, loved the, the church. church? He loved the church. And you know why God said it, that you should love your wife? as christ left the church and then he came to us he said wife submit to your husband when there is no love when there is no care how do you expect your wife to submit to you 
Christ loved your wife like Christ loved the church. Christ loved the church. He would never abuse the church. He would never let the church to stay dirty. He would never let things that are not supposed to be in our church. He will respect the church. He will make it leave it clean. He will do everything in his power. Okay? When a man loves his wife, let Christ love his church. Let me tell you something. When you give a woman all the love she deserves, you can even tell her to lay down, you put your foot over her, she will do it. Naja men, Naja women, when a husband loves them, they can come like this. Let me tell you what Naja men can say. My sister Chuka, uh, Chuka is uh, from Nigeria, Igbo too. Women will come like this if they met the Igbo men. Let's talk about the Igbo men because the Igbo men, they cherish their wives. They support their wife. They take care of their wife. The wife will come down to them and bow to them and call them Nai. Nai me, my husband, my master. That's what will happen. So let's go back to another comment here. Let's go back to another comment. Yeah, where or what's her name? Say, yeah, right. She said, why even cheat? Why you are still married? No, Ma, sometimes no. we just want to be spicy. You cheat on one. <laughs> she said she just want to be spicy. That's why. Thank you. Thank you, Jojo. Something you said, Matthew. You are most welcome, Matthew. You. Mm -hmm. And you can give example anytime I'm and we will talk about it. Okay, Darius said he's trying to join. What you do, copy the link and put it in your crown. Pull it in your cross search and then you can follow the prompt. If Master said something to come, too. Master yes, said, can you me. open the line so we can call in? Okay, Master, what you do, call me on Messenger. Like, hold on one minute. Uh, Jojo, I will give you the audience. I will go and get the, the boom box for, for the speaker to be loud, okay? So I will and, get the audience. I will be right back. And Chica said that I am blessed to have a husband that loves me like Christ loved the church. Hallelujah, hallelujah, hallelujah. For the woman to come up, that is a bold statement. For the woman to come up on a platform or a social media to say my husband loved me like Christ loved the church, that is beautiful. There is nothing more beautiful or touching or romantic than that. And you know what? I pray that the Lord seal that marriage, okay? That your husband continue to love you like Christ loved the church. That's the way marriage should be. And as he love you, my sister, as he love you like you're telling us today, as he love you like Christ love the church. May you respect him like the Bible said a wife should respect her husband. May you not think you are the hair. May he always be the hair. May you give him his respect. I pray for you that your marriage will continue to be what it is right now. I am so thankful to see a woman that is proud and a man that is treating her, his wife so good that she will be bold to say it. Chica, my heart out to you. We all looking for that man. I am looking for a man that will love me like Christ love the church. I am looking for that man, Chica. Until I get that man, if I will kiss 20 frogs, I will. If I marry and I don't get that man, I will keep moving on. We move. But I am let not it, to let, no it, let him call you. Let him call you. Listen back to the master. The line is open. Call me on Messenger. Call me on Messenger and then we'll put you on live, okay? I Call love you, Master Sachika, and God bless your marriage. And you have a wonderful husband. That's my child. And I'm praying for that kind of husband. Mm -hmm. Okay, uh, what's her name? Say, yes, so true, Jojo. So true, Jojo. Of course, that's it. That's Thank it. Thank you, Mama Roma, too. Romato, that is wrong. Why you are still married? That is wrong. We all know it's wrong. What they said, we know it's wrong. <laughs> if I was saying, we all know it's wrong. Trust me, we she know that it's wrong. Just want to for the spice of it. That's it. We all what they said, we know it's wrong. The Bible said that shall not commit adultery. Jehai said you shall not commit fornication. We all okay. know that. Yes. Trust me, we know the Bible. And even when you get all of your marriage, <laughs> even when you get all of your marriage, it starts the ending at the same fornication once you're not married. So we mm -hmm. all know we all we commit all know it's wrong. Uh, yeah, you know, I'm not yeah. saying that. it's not like I'm the person who said I always keep myself until I'm married. No, I'm not saying that. Mm. And I'm faithful for that. And I'm a safer person. But I'm just saying, I just like to do one at a time. I am no. not saying I have to uh, uh, be married before I, I, I have sex, which I'm praying for me to do something like that. But no. I have not done that before. 
I have not done that. It takes me a while for me to have sex with a man, but I have not done that to say, oh, I saved myself for marriage before. I have not done that. So I don't want no one saying that to say, oh, she, she married before she has sex. No, that's not what I said. Mm -mm. I always fornicating before I married that. Oh, that's what so I always me. Me. Okay? I But I always me. want to be with one at the Jojo. time. Jojo, no me. Even the pastors, I want to see which one of them will raise their hand up and say they were co shipping to the guy married, never has intercessual intercourse with a wife. The pastor and the second be sneaky. We just got to pray that God okay, will lead us. Pastors are world. worse. A lot of them are yes, worse. We just I, have to do my Lord. I'm not bringing no pastor down. I'm not joshing no pastor. I'm not joshing no bad. But all we need to do is to pray that God will give us the strength and energy to work on our salvation with fear and trembling. We're not joshing nobody because the same Bible said, Josh, not that he be Josh. But I know a lot of pastors when I was out there, when I was not in a relationship, I came and acted like they came holy, but still wanted to touch my breast, still wanted to sleep with me. You call yourself pastor. Yeah. My sissy Lord said thank you, thank you too, sweetheart. God yeah, bless know. you. I don't know what she's saying thank you about. Mm -hmm. and then what I don't know what you're talking about, but thank you about what, you know. So uh mm -hmm. then we got our uh, chica here, yeah, she say amen. Yes, this no, we bless God for you, honestly. The 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 basic uh 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 Colleen, what Kessely is not Kessely? Kessely, Kessely, right? Not Kessel, yeah, Kelly. That what I think. Kiss, uh, whatever. I'm sorry, my grandma always used to tell me your lower, know your lip best. The basic is that most African women are always funny excuses to leave the home. All the hundred good things the man did, you only hang on one mistake to leave them. Maybe that's the woman you're dealing with, my brother. Let me be honest with you. When you came from the, the initial stage, we, there were a lot of conversations about vice versa, right? If the woman is treating the man right, and if the man is treating the woman right, right, Jojo? So maybe the, the relationship that you have had, the woman is that one thing. But when me and Jojo sit here and say, we live in marriage or we live in a relationship, not because of one thing. Not because, not even because my husband cheated on me, or my husband had a child, or, so, or my husband had things that, you know, different things and happen consistently. Try to talk about it. And it's not working like the guy you say. If it's not working, get out. Let me tell you something. In this lifetime, in this country that we're living in, it's stressful. Can I tell you last night, I was talking in the elevator, I thought my people before after me. Hmm? A lot of things happen to you. I will tell you a lot of stories. I was talking in the elevator. Oh, I can't talk. I feel he laughing. I call my friend. She laughing at me. I said, "Drive." I was talking in the elevator. I told my friend, "Oh, I stopped me." Oh, in the chair, boy, I can't take the step. My job is on the seventh floor. What time will walk on seventh floor? But anyway, but let me, let me, let me. When you talk, let me. I will. You know, I like when the the the, the audience. You know, participate in it and bring a, a, a question or a comment. I'd like mm -hmm. to discuss it a little bit. But before I get into your comment, Cassidy, I will talk about this. With all the things that we would do to one another in relationship or in a marriage, only one thing that God took is said you can leave the marriage for adultery. Mm -hmm. Well, all the things he said you and your partner can go through, what I have been, whatever he called, nothing about any other thing. He no, no, said, no, 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 Josephine, I, I disagree. Go, go deep into the Bible. Chica is right here, Pastor Kali, I guess he watching with her. The Bible talk about abuse too in the relationship. Yeah, the I family. know. What I say is what, when the Bible says adultery, what he said you can divorce. It's about adultery. Now, let me come to your comment here. You said the basic the basis that most African women are always finding excuses let me to leave their home. All the hundred good things the men did. Now, let me stop right there. All the hundred good things the men did. I have a, all the hundred good things the woman did. Just because you are buying food in a house, bringing money in a house, doing other things in a house, doesn't mean you should abuse your wife. Does it mean you should be disrespectful to your wife? Does it mean you should cheat on your wife? So, Kathleen, 
If you think you're supposed to bring things and treat your woman on up away, be sleeping. Hello, Ramatu. Ramatu is yeah. live. We have a quarter on. Ramatu is live. Welcome to the Let's Talk About It with uh, Moku and Jojo, the table talk. And you are live. So what's your report? Well, thank you so much. I appreciate it. First of all, I want to know what's the topic today before I say what I want to say. The topic is to the topic today is a uh, why partners cheat on one another. Why? Why would make people what make people to cheat okay. on Okay, okay, okay. Why do people cheat why on would one make another? You yeah. Okay. Well, if I have to put my own tools in there, a lot of times I don't think people enter a marriage to see. First of all, it has to be something that's going on. One, second, maybe the person who they are. Some people enter a marriage for a different reason. Some people enter there to get to me. I'm part of the marriage group too. Some yep. people enter there to say, okay, I want to be married for the rest of my life. And some people go there, if your partner is not treating you right or respecting you, so people want to leave it and go out here. So if we say why people cheat, different, different reasons why people cheat. But for me, I would say why even cheat in a marriage? You don't have to be there. If you know you are not going to work, get out. Because if we come back to the Bible, I know I wrote that, I said why even cheat? It's wrong. I know we all know it's wrong. But who said we all know it's wrong? It is true. But what do we should look at again? There is no way you could be married and, and start cheating on your partner. Okay? That alone. But if you cheat on the person, you know what you're doing to the person? You know what is damage to the person on that person's life? You know the person, the person, they ain't, they ain't on something. And you know you see on there, that's what you see less of that self. Some people have low self esteem. For men that cheat on that person, they will speak for women. They can come and defend themselves. If for men that cheat, if that woman is not strong enough, do you know the damage to that person's life? But if you see the red flag, sometimes we see this red flag and we sit there. Yep. We don't pass our back to me. If you see more two, you're talking about it. It's not thinking. Get out. It's a red flag. Get out. You can get out. If you can leave for the marriage for two, three years, you're finished separating a long time ago. If you're divorced, move on with your life. And another thing, so this is just still just after I'm trying to say something about guy um talking about cheating and whatever you should go for you when we tell your partner in adultery. God gave you an option. It's not allowed. But a leeway you if you want to forgive the person, it's okay. But God against that work so funny. He 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 already like that. No. But if you want to forgive the person and say this is what my partner do to me, I'm gonna ain't no let it go and talk about it and forgive the person, it's okay. It's okay. Let a corona fight the option he gave you. He 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 totally against you. So this topic we need to bring it up more Muku Jojo. Thank you so much. You know, a lot of times we try to speak of these things, and people say, Oh, I know that it's happening in our home now. It's not what you think about, but they will not say what it can learn from it and wrong with it. They always want to point fingers, you know. So, yeah, thank you so much so, for so your right. platform. Uh -huh. Ramamatu will say thank you so much but this is a question to you you did mention that if your husband or your wife wrong you you should forgive them totally so what if you forgive them of certain things that they did and they continue to do it what do you do in that situation then it's an option to me thank you so much thank you so much Bye. Thank you so much, Ramatu. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Uh, and let me just go over what, uh, like she said. If your partner cheat on you, 
and you are ready to forgive the person. Like I said, the Bible said you can leave or, 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 or if someone commit adultery, but you can stay in it all. If your partner cheat and you're ready to forgive the person and you're working up, it is good. Second chance is also good, but you have to believe that the person is ready to cheat. I mean, I'm ready to change. And the person got to, you have to see that they are sincere in what they are saying and you give them that chance. But mm -hmm. if the person continue to do it, then yeah. you know that they're not going to change. And that person bringing a whole nother spirit. Mm -hmm. If you want to stay in it, it's on you. Be my guest, mm -hmm. yeah. So Ramatu, thank you. Share the life and thank you for always following us. Thank you for always being on our live. Let's put some more comments before the cat too much. Kessely, exactly. You are given option to leave the home. My point right there. Definitely. We all know that. We all know that. But we have to. We when, when, when we're discussing something here, we're not just gonna go the right way. We have to go the opposite way because there are people who go the opposite way to the right thing. You understand? So and thanks for your reply, Kessely. And, and let me be very honest with y'all on this platform. Like I told my mother, not everything I say on this platform is what I'm doing, but you have to go the other way in order to bring the conversation together. Okay? So guys, I just want you to know. I'm not going to outside there sleeping. <laughs> I just, you know, it's just a show. You cannot just be on point and say, oh, yes, I agree. I agree because there are people out there who does not agree to things that we are talking here. There are people who are going left and we are supposed to go right. So therefore, we have to bring this conversation together for us to know and people who are watching us that are in this situation to be able to learn. And secondly, we want you guys to know that whatever we are discussing on our platform, these are real life experiences. That does not mean we are going through the same thing or, you know, stuff like that. So I just want you to know it's only, you know, it's for everybody to learn. Okay? For everybody to learn. So thank you, Ramatu. Anybody else? Let's come in because I'm not getting all the other comments. You want to put the other the next one? Yeah, I'm put up the next one up. You are welcome. Okay. So true, yes. Yeah. So that's it. So you know, guys. So somebody wrote thing. some comments. There were some comments. I think one of the ladies that I said, my in Lord. Oh what yeah, oh, well, well, yeah. yeah I, put, I, I put it there when she I did I put it there, but we didn't discuss it. Hold on one minute, I'll find it right here. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Jojo. Okay, she said, Jojo, just my own personal option. Like your co-host said, if you are not sexually attracted to your partner, then I think the love oh, is good. And then you should make it. It is true, but you need to tell the person. Don't make the person feel like you guys are sitting in a relationship and then you're sleeping with another person. Then that's cheating. Yeah, that's cheating. Okay, so pretty much. Thank you for the comment. Look at it all I run away. You want your jack on me? They think we are magic. <laughs> Who think you are magic? She said, I can't join the comment on the thing with magic. What's up, Linda? This one say, Can you, uh, 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 Masa, I don't have, oh, you, Masa, you want the link? I can share the link. Yes, with you. Yes, with you. Well, how would you? Thanks for coming. Share the video. Continue okay. to come to our. All right, Masa, I'm about to share the link with you if you want to come on so I can share the link. If not, so you can call me on Messenger, okay? If you call me on Messenger, I will bring you on. Let me just share the link. My, uh, uh, Jojo will soon be leaving. Jojo will soon be leaving. So, uh... so uh, uh, I just put this, uh, about the what is called oh, to make the token hats. So as uh, Muku looking to try to get people on, we still read comments. So if you don't want to come on, it's okay. You can make a comment and we will always would like to involve our audience into the whole thing. So it just can be us. Whatever comment you make on that, we will make you feel like you're all here. We will discuss it. And if you think that we didn't see your comment, let us to know because we are him up and we will pass by some stuff that we, we, we did not see. So let us know and we will always discuss it. Yep.
Okay, Masa, I just sent uh, I just sent you the the com the the link. If you want to come on, you can come on. Yes, the topic here is why people cheat in their relationship. Why people cheat in a, or what make someone to cheat in a relationship? And I feel like if someone cheats, it means they want to cheat. If it is not okay, get out, get out. Masa, congrats, Masa told me congratulations, Lotta. Thank you, sweetheart. I'm trying to hold on there, Masa. I'm trying to be a good girl, okay? I never know. Who knows? Mr. Red will come. I'm looking. You know, I talk to people briefly, like, blah, 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 just, say, just hard thing. I don't even like to go into it. All right, so people can just say well, who she thinks she is. So I make like another but. You know, I'm trying to just watch out there, especially when you are a mother. You have to be very, very careful. Masa, I sent you the link, or you can call me on Messenger. Oh God, the thing with magic. That's it. Say you are so right in spirit, of course. <laughs> Yeah, you know, we got to, we, when we're bringing our children up, the way we act around our children is also a way of training the kids. So Darius, I'm very, very careful with that. Darius, I don't know how you're not getting the link, but I send it in your messenger if you want but to. can you call? Darius, you can call, you can call me on messenger. Call me on messenger. You can call me on messenger if you want to be a part of the show. Yeah, this is why the Western, oh yeah, was saying that because Matthew said we like to act like the Western people. Sir, this is why we are in the Western world and this is why our partner sent us to school. Yes. Our parents sent us to school. Our parents yeah. sent us to school. I'm so sorry. So you think my mom and pa sent me to school for me to be acting like some dummy here? You just see over my head? No, 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 man. Wake up, man. Treat your wives and all your partners good. Okay. We all should be able to put rest in the rest, cocoa and cocaine. We all should be able to map the flow. We all should be able to do laundry. Okay? That's what, that's respect. That's love. That's care. That's relationship. That's partnership. Rola, welcome. You always lit. <laughs> no, she been here. <laughs> you gave me Rola hat. <laughs> uh, <laughs> So guys, uh, thank you so much for being a part of it. It's almost will be out at 11 o'clock. So if you want to make your, sub, your, your submission, don't hesitate to comment or come on. You know, if you want to come on the live, I'll send you the link. This is not a regular Facebook live, so you can just request a Facebook live. Okay? So if you want to be a part of this, you can just, you know, voice whatever. So, and make some comments, people. Let's discuss. We have like let's say probably 10 minutes. We've been all here, I don't know for how long now. So that was what we've been on since 9:20. And mm -hmm. almost 11, that almost two hours. And it feels like we were just on for five minutes. Whatever, man. I still love Rhoda, you. Too. Can you get some points here, Rhoda? Come on, you have some things to say. Rhoda, I'm yes. sure you have some burning fire questions in there. Make this stop and this step up. Make this step up hot. Okay? Rhoda, say something. Let's like discuss it. I know you got it in you. Come on, girl. Let's go. Bring up something. Rhoda, I got to get a whole gist of the comment because you just got me. Rhoda, why people cheat? Or why people walk away to cheat on that relationship? It is, is it a good thing? Is it okay if someone cheat on you, you cheat on them back? Is it okay what? to stay in a relationship? Your partner continue to cheat on you. Is it okay to keep it since you married? It's for better or for worse. So if the person continually cheating on you, you should stay in it. Is that okay? Me the day if I cheat, if I cheat on my husband, I will come and say I cheated on you because I don't want you. I will. There you go, my poor sister. I am. I will tell you. I know when I'm getting ready to say I make sure my phone is on speed dial. Now I want one. <laughs> and maybe that's the reason why I don't do it because I'm very poor. If mm -hmm. you're going to ask me something, I don't feel like there is no human being that can stay in front of me that I can tell you what I have to tell you. So if Call you're me. going to ask me a question, I'm going to tell you what I think it is. Call me on Messenger, Rhoda. If you want to come on, if you want to call, call Messenger. If you want to come on, let me so, know. I will send you the link. I'm having if a I, I, I will send it. So, Rhoda, if you want to come on, way. call me on Messenger. Uh, Jojo will be leaving at 11 o'clock. We'll be going off at 11. 
So this was 9 20 to 11. I got to get off at 11 so I can go to the lost house and practice worship. Okay, I got to go to the worship practice, you know. In this world, we have to continue doing the work of God and fellowshipping and coming on here and talking and chatting, you know. That's the way Jesus sat with sinners for you to be able to win people over. We all are sinners. So they got people who act like they cannot poo poo. They get people who act like they can't even walk on this ground, okay? It's always good for us to, you're not better than anyone. As much as I joke here or whatever, I will never hold myself high. I will always come down to my friends and we all can, you know, I love friendship. So I will never hold myself like this, no. Because some people, they, that was even to the women. A lot of the women these days, they think they can't poo poo. They act like they don't the friends. Okay, Rola's calling. Rola calling. Oh, I can't get some stuff. Good morning, Rola Huff. You are live, and we say welcome to the. You are live, and we say welcome to the table talk. Morning, 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 Jojo. What's your story? Welcome, family. <sighs> you know, I was just saying, I was just listening to you, so people, they come in, they come in, they come in, come in and I didn't want to call in, but, uh, you know, two things for me, two things I don't like, I hate life, and I hate for people to cheat on me, and I'm sure nobody likes that, but people cheat not because, oh, they get excuses why they cheat, but people cheat because they want to cheat. Or a person will cheat because they want to. No, I don't cheat spontaneously. No. Not just because they say, oh, I just, I just want to go cheat. No. Before you cheat, there's something you know. Even if it's not looking ahead of time, you know it before you decide to cheat, before you went there to cheat. Okay? People will say, oh, I cheat because my wife cannot do this. Or, oh, I cheat because my husband cannot tell me this. But for me, I always say, I cheat because they cheat. If you think that person is not doing something to you talk to that other, then you let them know they not what you to do, whether it's the husband, whether it's the wife, if you said we're going to tell them, okay, you have to read this to me. You have to read this to me. If you tell them, okay, and let us see you told them. Let an old lady say, or uh, uh, one of the brothers say, I don't, it's not, it, it's not the right to go ahead and cheat on the person because I just don't care. You are putting another spiritual for your marriage. That's a whole different thing right there. You are putting another spiritual for your marriage in the Bible. You have to be on to fight. So that's a whole different thing you are putting. That's a whole different thing of water right there. Okay? That's a whole different water. It's too crazy. Because so many things can happen. You can put that on STD. Mm -hmm. uh, and your marriage, you know, it is your uh, 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 so time, so time, okay? Mm -hmm. which is very, very good. All right? So, uh, for me, I don't, I, I don't like that. You don't want to be in the marriage. Everybody say you get out. You are not forced, you are not forced to. But there's so much cheese on you. Whether it's a husband, whether it's a wife, and you think that, okay, I want to be a person. You guys sit down and talk about it, then I think that you let it go. Because sometimes, or most times, when you just get the people to have to have a baby, and then they still bring it up. They still bring it up. You know, you hear the man say, okay, this is what you're doing, and you still bring it up. But if that person, let it go. Start on a clean street. All right? Trust that person. Don't be thick in a place where I'm going somewhere. What is going to this? Is it going to that place? No. Just have a clear mouth to have to get that person. For me, if you say you, 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 you fire it, I can't see the penalty of the doubt. Okay? I will get you a penalty of the doubt before you get me or you can not have to trust you anymore. But if I say I'm going to trust you, if I say, okay, I decide to forgive you, you know, and next I knew, I'm going to forgive you. Until I see that, or maybe a reason not to trust you again. If I not to trust you again, I decide that I don't want to put my own again. I choose, I choose to get out. It's my choice, you know. 
It's my choice. So, and like the court of death, there's no reason for people to be in a, in a marriage or in a relationship. You are there with somebody. If you don't want to be there, don't, don't go. Get out. Because that's the whole mind thing. It's the whole mind thing. That person makes that emotional effect that person. You know? It's not good at all. It's the whole flesh. It's the whole radical thing. All those things are like our body is all of it. All right? So these people are going to be found. They're going to be able to be in a relationship. They just get out to life. If that is not going to be able to be in a yeah, oh, for me to be for me, I don't want to be there, I will not be there. I will get out. So help me God. That is my input for the day. Thank you guys. I have to have to get out. Thanks for your time. I have to make sure I have to get out. We appreciate you. Thank you for coming on. We love you, girl. Thank you, Thank you for all the hard work you guys. Thank you. And like I let me say something, Moku. Cheating is not a mistake. It is not. You can forgive the person that's okay, but what I, I just want to do is premeditate that. You can premeditate that. You can premeditate that. You can close out. That premeditation. You already planned to do it. And it's not a mistake, okay? You made up your mind to do it. You guys decided to go in that clothes room. You guys decided to take off your clothes. You decided to, look, it's not a mistake. I mean, you can apologize. I'm not saying that when your husband cheat on you, you should just walk away. If you still love your husband, you want to work here, you can get over it, you can pass it. You can do that and you can go to counseling and work it up. But we hope that may mind don't turn around again. Mm -hmm. And I got one more thing to say about this cheating. The most law said, if a husband has sex with another woman or the man has sex, when or the woman has sex with another man, then you commit adultery. Okay, mm -hmm. Jesus said, not only sleeping with another person, but the way in which you look at another person could be adultery. So mm -hmm. I want you guys to understand that cheating is not only physical. If a mm -hmm. man is looking at that woman in that skirt. And looking at her in a way that he think he acts want to go through that sex and, and skirt and he thinking about like having sex with her, he had already committed adultery or fornication. So I want, mm -hmm. I just wanted to make it clear that Jesus mm -hmm. said not only physical, but the way in which you look at a person could be a sin. So men, ladies, the women looking at that man like, damn. He's so hot, I can't wait to eat. And you're feeling that way, you already have sex. So, yeah, yes. Jojo, Jojo, no one can say this here on the pool. Hmm. Oh, let me, let me, let me laugh before I read, right? You want me to read or you want to read? Go ahead, though. <laughs> no marriage is comparable. Com yeah. Com what you say? No marriage is comparable no marriage because comparable. because because both both partners are from different upbringing. Uh, there's something unique about your partner that gets you attracted to him or her. Every single day, people to learn to work on these com compatibility compatibility. Compatibility. So, if when I have a wonderful relationship with my wife, just for you and option. Thank you. That's no marriage. Like you said, no marriage is compatible. It is true because both partners are from different upbringing. Yes, it's true. Deep down, yes, there's something unique about your partner that gets you attracted to him or her every single day. People should learn to work on these comparabilities to a point i have i have a wonderful relationship with my wife just my view yeah you're That's right true. you're because right you work on it, what we see is if the person continue to do you're not expecting someone to continue to forgive you and you keep cheating that is the problem and if you have a good relationship with your wife thank you and continue to have the good relationship with your wife 
okay mm -hmm. then i hope that um your wife is um having a good the see she feels the same about you okay because your first question it came up boom so i hope that you know you are that husband who try to help around the house too mm -hmm. and uh, are working mm -hmm. along with that western woman whatever western relationship okay Look at the other busy sister in good day, sister. She just coming on. Let's bring us to the end of our broadcast. We say thank you guys for your participation. Jojo, you have, can you put your phone you down a little bit? On your phone. Oh, yeah. Thank you. Welcome. Okay. Welcome to our live broadcast. We say thank you for your submission. Thank you for your uh, your comments, thank you for participating. And we say above all, thank you for the support. And we hope you share this live broadcast. If you want to be a part of this broadcast, you want to be able to, to guest host with us, don't hesitate to let me know. If you have a topic, just let me and Jojo know. We will definitely will be able to, to talk about what of the mind, you know, we are here, we are here to like the mind of our people. There are things that our people out there we don't know about, and most of the things that we discuss here are from our audience. We do talk to us and we talk about this. And like I said, not everything that Google Space Yes is doing. I only do that because we're not only just going to go and call it to the Bible. We got secular people who watch us, we got people who don't believe in Jesus Christ and the power of the right which is so sad. But yeah, this day we are here to, to accommodate everybody and listen to everybody but and options on this platform. We are here to build, to discuss everything with the exception of politics. This platform is for politics and it's for people. We are here to uplift and we are here to build together. There are things we hear here, we we'll learn from here in our relationship, in our marriages. Okay, guys, and in our so we say thank you to Luma Agu. We are excited to follow all our platforms, and uh, I will turn it over to you to give a closing statement. And I want to say thanks to the audience. Thanks for supporting us. You know, we come up with our time and just say boom, this is it. We're coming on, and sometimes we give you guys less than an hour, less than thirty minutes, and you guys show up. Thanks for your inputs, your comments, your core, your support, your love. We love you guys. You guys understand that America, this is the way life is we we can stop going but you always come and no matter what we give you guys 20 minutes you'll come and support us so we would love for you guys to share and if you want you have anything to give uh, 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 um, stars or uh, uh, cash up you are more welcome because we got things that we need to do and we need your help and we look forward to you guys if you have any comments that we said we don't say that for whole we're looking for what to talk about we just come out from from people so if you have something that you want us to discuss just get in our inbox let us know and trust me whatever comment as you see as people put comments we read a comment because we don't want to be the only one on here we want you guys on and what we call table talk we're on the table as you guys whom you on the table also thank you thank you and thank Thank you. And we we'll see you next week. We'll see you next week and welcome to thank you. And this brings us to the end of our broadcast. Don't hesitate to follow our platform. And uh, the page is best for the Google online platform. Thank you so much. God bless you. Happy Mother's Day to all our wonderful and faithful mothers out there. Our strong mother and I say to you, never underestimate the power of the mother. Never yes. estimate the strength of a woman. We love you guys. Guys, remember now, women born men and men, women born women. Okay? And guys, make sure you treat your baby mom, mama out there. Even if you guys are not together, you are your children, you share that bond. Treat her. Treat that mother. 12 months in a year. She nurture the kids. She takes them to school. 99% do 100% of everything. Don't forget to cherish your mother out there. I love you guys. Happy Mother's Day, Jojo. I know you're going to have a fabulous family. Love you guys. Bye-bye.